Hello friends, this is Chalpesh here and welcome again to my channel Code with JV. In this video, we are going to see how we can use Twitter streaming API with Node.js. So basically like uh, in, in this video, we are going to see how uh, we can get the real time tweets about the particular topics on uh, from the Twitter API. So first thing first, uh, we need to go to developer.twitter.com and here we need to create uh, go to dashboard sorry not dashboard in the apps and you need to create one app there i already created the app uh, called jvstream and basically you can you need to put basic things there some url so this is my youtube channel url and then we have some keyboards and tokens that we needed uh, for the uh, Twitter streaming APIs and uh, we are going to have a permission so right now I have given all the permissions uh, like read write and direct messages so that way like I can do a uh, read the tweet I can directly message if a few of the stuffs there and uh, then we can have a uh, uh, like uh, use of this particular Twitter uh, developer API so once uh, you are done with creating uh, keywords and tokens, uh, we need to go into the Visual Studio Code. Uh, so I am going to show you which Twitter uh, packages we, I have used. So basically here you can see like uh, I have used very few packages there. So it's like Express and uh, then we uh, I have used uh, .environment uh, to store my uh, keys into the environment uh, file and then uh, I have used tweet which is uh, uh, open source npm uh, for using uh, for using the twitter ap uh, application so it's very easy to use so here you can see and I have done the same thing and if you see the code like I have done like very few line of code so basically what I have done is like I have uh, got uh, the tweet object from the required then what I have done is uh, like I have uh, got uh, the object of t from new tweet with the all the ids that is uh, like configurations credentials required for the node.js twitter api and then just what I have done is like I have subscribed to particular Twitter screens and here are the keyword which we want to track like so if there is any tweet about this then like our app, app get uh, those tweets and it will show into the uh, console via this console.blog so here you can see like it is a web socket and I have subscribed to that particular tweet WebSocket, and we are going to whenever we get any tweets, uh, we are going to have it printed. So it's very easy. Uh, you, here you can see, like I have uh, written like only like few ten, 10 lines of code to get this kind of stuff. And now let's run that API. So what I am going to do is I am going to run it in the command prompt. So whenever somebody hits the tweet about this uh, particular uh, stuff, we are going to have here something. So let's wait for a few moments. I think uh, there will be some tweets about India fights against Corona. Otherwise, we can have multiple keywords also. Let's search for some of the keywords. So, let's check this one Lockdown India. And we are going to run it again. So here you can see like uh, somebody has uh, uh, created the tweets so here you can see like whatever tweets are going with this particular hashtag it's coming there 
so like that's it like it's very easy to create this kind of applications and here you can see like i have written majorly written like this line job code because like this code is all uh, to get uh, the credentials from the .env file so i hope you like this video and let me know like what kind of videos you want to see on my particular channel so i can uh, i can provide those kind of videos and if you like this video then please do not forget to subscribe to my channel here is the url thank you for watching this video